Hi guys, me again. Um, I've just done an unboxing, so I'm going to do another one for you now. A quick one again. So if you say hello, give me a like, please. Um, I'm not sponsored by anybody. This is just me doing stuff that hopefully you guys can see. So let's get started. I'll get. I just grab it. Da da. So the first one was. Uh, I did earlier, which is this huge monitor right there. So gorgeous. So it's fragile, so we'll try and be a little bit fragile with it. I know exactly what it is, but yeah. Um, I know that you guys all would have seen this many, many, many times, but I don't know. Maybe you might get some people that might start following me. Stuff like that. Careful with the knife and don't cut myself. This is just an added addition to my an added addition to my uh, computer. As I said earlier, I am building my daughter a computer, so I need the stuff for mine. I keep getting all my old stuff, which is it's not that old either. It's pretty pretty damn good actually. So she's gonna have a very nice PC. Trying to get her away from Apple. <laughs> She's an Apple lover. Oh, I nearly dropped it. Oops, I nearly dropped the knife too. Okay, guys. I shall give you. Oh, God. that's just the invoice. I paid one forty-eight for this, and I shall show you. Ta -da! This is what I bought for my PC. Everyone knows all the stuff on there. It's a um, 380 or 360 red um, Corsair. It's a new one, so we'll just see how we go. I, I, I'll give it a quick little unboxing. I'm trying to adjust this down, guys, a little bit for you guys to have a bit of a look. See down here what I'm doing. Can you see? Yes, you can. They even put a little bit of string on it. I don't know why, but thank you. It's so, I love opening boxes. Okay, which end do we open? Doesn't really matter, does it? Just be careful, don't I don't cut myself. Okay, that's off. I know you've probably seen this a thousand times, but you never see me do it. Oops. Okay, let's turn this thing over. Where is it open from? I think it's. Oh, there we go. I was going to say, I think it's John Proof. Oh, hang on. Like that. Ooh, like that. It opens. Um, manuals, of course, warranty manual, warranty guide, I don't know, installation guide. Um, it's pretty basic, everyone knows how to do all this sort of stuff, but there, it's just the installation. It's a nice little phone, don't need that. These are the fans, of course, that they, they come with, which should be four pin, so they can be controlled. There should be uh, three of these, there must be one somewhere else. Oh, there it is there. I was going to say, where's the other one? Um, which is four pin. Um, pretty basic fans, I don't know if I'll use these yet, but we'll see. Um, like I said there's a spare radiator. I mean, another another um, fan, another one here. It is a um, 360. Okay. We'll get this thing out. 
we don't need a box anymore. Yeah. And that's what it looks like, guys. This one is, um, as I said, it's a two, it's 120 radiators. Now the, um, the, do, 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 the name just went out of my head. The H115 radiator is small, of course. Um, that's uh, two something, whatever it is, it doesn't matter. But it's got the bigger radiators, they're 240s on that. Oh, sorry, 140 radiators on that. This is only um, 120s. And of course, there's your pump with thermos paste supplied, which I'm looking forward to doing. Uh, I don't like these wires, but I should be able to hide them in my case. I've got the um, Republic of Gaming um, case, so I should be able to hide them. Now, how the hell? It only runs that way, so how the hell am I supposed to, if I want to do a push me pull, I'll have to change it. It's got a SATA con connection, which is good. I hate them other stupid connections because they're so old. But anyway, there you go, guys. Quick little look, overview. I'll give you a look later. I'm going to do a blog later um, on what I've done to my case. Uh, in the baggie, in the baggie is just some screws. And one of, oh, there's something else I should mention. If you're putting the... I've got the H100i in my case at the moment. If you're doing that, remember to change the this wire, um, which goes to a USB um, port on your on your motherboard. It's supposed to be different. I don't know how, but it is. Um, I think what I can say about this is. Corsair needs to lift their game. Look at that. You can see that through there. That should be all the way up to here. That is just crap. That is just really B grade work Corsair, as far as I'm, I am concerned. You don't do that, so now I'm gonna to have to try and get some shrink wrap Put it right up to there try and get it over this uh, I might have to pop these out I don't know yet but hopefully I can get the shrink wrap over it and then put it on there and shrink it make it look a bit nicer than that okay guys that's all I wanted to show you of course everyone knows little nuts and bolts that come in the package I don't need to show you all these this is the one I'll be using I don't have to because I've already got the one on the back of my case for the H100 I bet I'll, I'll put this one on because I'm going to give that one to my daughter anyhow so I'll change all this as well. Um, you don't use this one not unless you because that's the Intel one. This is for the the other sort. I don't know how to use it so it's a metal. Looks pretty solid. And that plus all your screws. I hope they've got two really nice long screws there. I did want to set this up as a push me pull so how I'm going to do that I do not know. Um, because on that, it's only got three radiators, so I must have to get a, uh, an, an adapter. That's just silly. But anyway. All right, guys. I'll come back up to me. All right. So I'll just give you a quick overlook of that, and we'll see how we go. I'm not happy with the with just the three fans, because I did want to do a push-me-pull. Um, so it sucks. I'll have to do something. There must be, there's got to be something I can do. Um, anyway, remember, thumbs up, guys. Thank you very much. Have a great day.